Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. I'm Christina, a mom of two. I'm here to talk to you about everything and anything parenting and babies. But today we are talking about the breast friend versus the boppy, which one I prefer and some hacks. So let's just get right to it. I cannot say enough good things about the breast friend. They come in different covers. It's one piece of foam, but it's kind of a fun shape, a little bit funky shape. Um, it comes in like micro fleece or in cotton. What I love about it is that it has a pocket. And when my baby was young, I would put a burp cloth in here and I would always lay the burp cloth on top of the pillows just in case he spit up. So I love that it has the pocket. It's so helpful. The other really cool thing is that it has this back support. As you can see, it actually has some structure back here. So when you bring it around your back, it offers you some support in the back. You can buckle it. And I think the micro fleece one has actually a Velcro strap, but the same idea. And then you can adjust it. So you just pull it nice and tight. It sits right in your lap. And this is great for C-section mamas. You can lift it up above the incision and you can pull it nice and tight. So it offers some support. So a lot of times breastfeeding moms um, who use the boppy will end up like hunching forward because the pillow doesn't have a lot of structure. So you have to kind of compensate. Um, where the breast friend, this offers a lot of support with memory foam. So it's like more structured and harder. So you can tighten it. Only kind about this is this is just a breastfeeding pillow or a feeding pillow. This is not um, as versatile as the Boppy, but it does offer a lot more support. The really cool thing about the Boppy is that it's washable and you can actually take it out of the pillowcase, wash just the pillow or wash this, um, the cover. You can buy tons of different covers as well. So what I like about the Boppy is that it is um, easy. You can wash the whole thing if you get milk on it. Some things I didn't love about the Boppy is that it's pretty bulky. It's not easy to store. Um, it doesn't have a pocket or anything. It's, it doesn't have a lot of structure, so you can't really adjust where it is on your body. All right, so if you are looking for a breastfeeding pillow, I would definitely go with the Breast Friend. Lots more structure, lots more um, support for your baby. And I like that it has the pocket so you could store a bunch of stuff. If you are looking for something more versatile, yes, Boppy's the way to go. It's cheaper and it's got more uses. Let's talk about some of those other uses here. If you're traveling like on an airplane and you don't want to bring the Boppy, but you use it a lot at home and you um, obviously need some sort of pillow for your baby, you can fold this up and bring it on the airplane, throw it in your diaper bag. And when you get on the airplane, ask for some blankets and pillows and just stuff it. Um, that way you can use it on the airplane and not have to worry about bringing the whole pillow. And when you get to the hotel, you can stuff it with a pillow and it'll kind of just shape since this is already in the shape that of a, a boppy. You just buy this like seven to $10 cover. You can actually put stuffing in it and you don't have to buy the $40 pillow. You can just make your own boppy by adding stuffing in here. Now that's not gonna make it machine washable, but it saves you 40 bucks. So you can actually use this as a pillow to sit on. Uh, it adds a little bit of cushion so you're not sitting right on your seat. So you actually would just put it in your seat like a donut ah, and just lifts you up. So it takes a little bit of pressure off of your sit muscles and your seat. And without going into too much detail, you can probably imagine what I'm talking about. Um, so this is a good way to help recovery postpartum. For baby, when they get a little bit older, you can actually sit them down in it and use it as like a back support. You can do tummy time on it. There's a lot of different things you can do with it that are not breastfeeding or nursing or feeding a baby. That's it guys, we are all done. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe and leave me a comment on which one you used with your baby and why you liked it better. Come on back and check out some more videos about some baby items and some parenting hacks and I'll see you next time. Bye.